are watching BNS News. Today's headline: Coinbase backed on to finance announces a pack expansion plans. Vitalik Buterin shares controversial statement about crypto companies. Ethereum devs expects 10x lower rollups cost as Dencon upgrade hits testnets. Virginia State Senate reduces cryptocurrency rights bill. Donald Trump wants to protect America from CBDC threat received support. HANA Gateway launch trustless crypto fiat transactions with privacy. Terraform Labs declares bankruptcy in Delaware. Treasury issues alert following third party security breach. Value logged in DeFi surpasses $57 billion, securing over $20 billion in three months. Neithermind pushes hot fakes after client caused invalid blocks on Ethereum. New X payments accounts to speculations of crypto offerings. Investigated coin scam operation has stolen $32 million since April block fence. In a strategic move on to finance, a prominent US-based issuer of tokenized securities backed by Coinbase has set foot in the Asia-Pacific, capitalizing on the region's surging interest in digital assets. Ethereum founder Vitalik Buterin, one of the most influential figures in the crypto industry, has recently articulated some provocative views on the subject, steering robust discussion within the community. The Ethereum ecosystem is edging closer to significantly lower gas fees and faster transaction speeds for layer 2 rollups as the Dencon upgrade hits the network's three test nets in early 2024. The Virginia State Senate has introduced legislation delimiting regulations for mining and transactions of digital assets, their treatment under tax laws. Donald Trump is once again the race to become the next U.S. president later this year in 2024. In one of his campaign speeches, Donald Trump recently vowed to oppose the creation of central bank digital currency Aka Digital Dollar, HANA Gateway serving as the gateway wallet between crypto and the real world, offers a sefi like self-custodial user experience complete with trustless on-off ramp, interoperability and privacy. Additionally, it facilitates peer-to-peer -peer transactions between fiat and crypto assets, allowing these exchanges to be realized without the need for an intermediary. The impartial cryptocurrency firm behind the field stablecoin TerraUSD declared in the filing it has between $100 to $500 million in estimated assets and the same amount in liabilities. TerraUSD, a dollar pegged cryptocurrency, and Terra's Luna token collapsed in May 2022, destroying billions of dollars in investor wealth. Leading hardware wallet provider Trezor has issued an alert to its users about a potential phishing threat following a security breach reported at third-party support platforms.